Hello there Apps by Viewers, my name's Peter and I've got a hands-on preview for you, this time it's with Jets. Jets is from KLM, uh, yes, that KLM, the KLM that runs uh, an airline, and basically this is an endless flyer, you're playing as this little um, paper aeroplane here, and you've got to collect these stamps for, they're essentially like coins I suppose, they, they kind of get you some unlocks, and in this mode I'm trying to, oh, I've been trying to get clocks to extend my time but there's different modes as well it's a, you know, there's a, a little thing there where you can play on for a certain amount of the uh, premium currency so let's go to the home option load times aren't too bad at all this this is the main menu we've got create a challenge uh, pending challenges and single player something went wrong I can't access the multiplayer at the moment that but I think that's because I'm in a preview build at the moment um, so I've just been playing the single player but there is a social sharing multiplayer element there are different uh, stages as well again I mean I'm in the first one I'm in Amsterdam the others haven't been available yet and I've unlocked different types of missions that I have to play. So I was on time travel, this is Sneaky Pigeon, Stamp Collector. Stamp Collector just has you grabbing those stamps that you saw earlier. And then there are power-ups as well, so you can use these different power-ups to give yourself an advantage. I'm not going to go with the power-up though. And then we just hit the play button and we get into the game proper. Uh, the game is coming out on the 20th of May and I'm, I'm interested in it simply because, well, it's a game from an airline company. KLM's done a couple of these games now, I've just got to hit this pigeon, bam, thwack you. Uh, and uh, yeah, they've done a few of these and they've invariably been pretty good if slightly derivative versions or takes, I suppose, on other genres of game. And this is a take on an endless runner. Um, the, the way that it kind of differentiates itself is that you've got multiple levels of flight there, Look, as you can see, there's much more than your usual lean left, lean right, jump and slide underneath objects. This is there's much more freedom in this than there is in your traditional auto runner. But other than that, it definitely feels uh, similar. Uh, I don't, you know, if, you, if you've sworn off the auto runner genre, then this isn't going to bring you back into the fold. But there's plenty of missions, plenty of variety. The visuals look pretty darn good, and uh, yeah, like it's it's a unique offering from a from a space in games development that doesn't often get explored. So there we are. That is Jets. Do let me know if you think that this is neat in the comments. This is Peter with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.